proper work just given everything that's gone on the last two years? Is it this offseason feel different? Uh, no, nah, not really for me. I felt like it was same offseason, just different months <laughs> pretty much. But it was a great offseason. Uh, got some great work in and most importantly got to uh, kick it with the fam. Um, just trying to get better. Uh, I feel like the objective every year is just trying to come in with a clean slate and just try to be, come in as a better player. Uh, as simple as it sounds, I mean, it's a lot of hard work that goes into it. But just trying to come in better, uh, trying to come in as a better leader and just be a better person on and off the court every year. Uh, when you live with those goals and those aspirations, I feel like everything else takes care of itself. Uh, start. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I feel like I feel like definitely a veteran on on this team uh, with the with the things that I've seen in this league. Um, so just trying to give the young young guys. Well, I'm young too. <laughs> just trying to give my teammates uh, knowledge on uh, different situations and just trying to connect with them as much as possible. And especially our rookies. I, I know how tough it is to be a rookie. And I was thankful to have uh, great vets when I came in. So. Just them being able to lean on me for anything. And when I say anything, I mean anything. Have you and uh, Zayden had any dunk competitions yet, or is that still to come? Uh, not yet, not yet. I might give it to him. I might just let him have it. <laughs> he got them young legs, fresh out of college. I might just let him have it, but he know. He know He know the real. <laughs> I think the biggest thing is just that we're all looking for is just excitement, uh, just trying to bring excitement back to the city. Um, and it's it's, a, it's an objective for us. Uh, we understand uh, what we need to do. We understand where we were, and we understand where we're trying to get to. So every day is just hard work, uh, battling with each other, arguing with each other from top to bottom. I mean, because we're trying to figure it out. Uh, we're trying to do something special. We're trying to be great. And most importantly, we're just trying to do it for the city. We know how much the city loves basketball, and we know how much it's important for the city to have a, a good basketball, competitive basketball team. And this group that we got, we're just trying to do that this year, trying to be competitive and just trying to leave it out on the court every night. I feel like that's something that we can do. Uh, that doesn't take any talent. I don't feel like that doesn't take making or missing shots. That doesn't take uh, playing great defense, I mean. When you say being competitive and you're saying having a team that the city relates to and the city's identity is competing, grit, and just being a team that doesn't take no, no bullshit, for real. So just trying to go out there and do that every night and try to do it to the highest standard that we can and just hold ourselves accountable to that. Uh, it's great when you say uh, Jaden and Jalen. I mean, those guys can run, they can fly, and it's it's gonna be exciting. I mean, just being able to have uh, Jalen, a, a great shot blocker. He's caught me a couple times, so I mean, that says a lot. I mean, just having having him protecting the rim and Jaden, a guy that could just dribble up and go by anybody that he wants to go by. I mean, that's that's something to say within itself. So. Like I said, man, I mean, with the whole group we got from uh, top to bottom, I mean, it's just very exciting to see see it all come together and see us all fight together and, most importantly, see us try to bring something special to the city together. From a standpoint, what are your, your hopes and expectations for this team? Uh, for, me, I'm, for me, it's simple. Uh, just come in, uh, do what I know I could do, and just let the chips fall where they fall. I mean, like I said, most importantly, it's trying to bring something special to the city. It's not about me. It's not about nobody else. It's all about how we can all do it collectively. So if we all can get on the same page and we all can have the identity that we need to have on the court, I feel like everything else would take care of itself. So for expectations, I started off with it. When I, when I first came in, I said, um, 
I just want to be better than last year. Uh, you said with the career numbers, the career minutes, stuff like that. I mean, none of that stuff really affects me. I feel like I put in the work each and every day. So whenever, whatever opportunity it is, whatever situation it is, I'm, I'm prepared for it and just trying to fight every day for real. Um, I thought about it a little bit, um, just with the interaction that I had with him. Um, let his let God rest his soul. Um, he's a great person, um, definitely a motivator. I mean, when I was in Charlotte uh, during All Star Weekend, uh, I got to sit down and eat dinner with him. So that's a blessing within itself uh, for me, being able to have that interaction with him. So I feel like this number six holds more value because I mean, I actually got to interact with him and I actually got to get to know him a little bit and talk to him so the six holds more value to me and I feel like being the last person able to wear it as a piston it's an honor and I'm trying to make sure that the same way that's an honor that my performance is as well so um, I, I'm clearly aware of aware of that and like I said I'm, I'm just trying to stay ready so I don't got to get ready appreciate you guys yeah.